Today, we are going to show you how to make delicious, silky soya milk pudding right in your own kitchen. First, you'll need 200 g of dried soybeans. Make sure to soak them in water overnight to soften them up. 15 g rock sugar, 100 ml of milk, pandan leaves, 4 tablespoons of sugar, 1,500 ml of water, 3 g ogak strands, 25 g ogak powder, 1 can rambutan stuffed with pineapple, 1 bowl of syrup from the can rambutans. After soaking, drain the soybeans and rinse them thoroughly. Let's start by preparing the soya milk. Add the soybeans to the blender with a bowl of water. Blend the soybeans and water together until smooth, creating a creamy mixture. Next, strain the mixture using a nut milk bag or cheesecloth to separate the soy milk from the pulp. Squeeze out as much liquid as you can, ensuring you get all that delicious soy milk goodness. Repeat for the remaining soybeans. Add the pandan leaves. Bring the pot to boil. Stir well until it boils. Let it simmer for 5 to 10 minutes. This allow the additional fragrance from the pandan leaf. Next, boil two bowls of water in a pot. Add in the ogak strands, along with the rock sugar. To increase the chewiness texture, sprinkle in the ogak powder while continuously stirring to avoid any lumps. Add a bowl of syrup from the can rambutans for extra flavors. Mix in a bowl of sugar to increase its sweetness. Let the mixture simmer for a few minutes until the ogak is fully dissolved. Get a taste. Add extra sugar if necessary. Pour in the milk while continuously stirring. Pour in the soya milk. Pour the mixture into individual serving cups or molds and let it cool to room temperature. Once cooled, refrigerate the pudding for a few hours until it sets and becomes silky smooth. That's it. This concludes the steps for our homemade silky soy milk pudding. Like, share to your friends and subscribe if you find this useful. Now, it's time for you to prepare and enjoy yours.